The Invitation. I asked her if she wanted to come over for Thanksgiving. The Addition. When did they discuss bringing the dog with them? About an hour before she was on her way to my house. That's real golf. May I add something? You can add nothing. The danger. I know because my dog's a pit bull, it's got prejudice against it. The attack. And the dog killed their dog. On her birthday, in front of an entire horrified family. Judge Judy. Mr. Medina, before Thanksgiving of last year, had you ever been to the plaintiff's home? No, so that was the first time I visited. Before Thanksgiving of last year, had you ever met the plaintiffs? I had not. The plaintiffs have family and a house. Yes. And apparently a very nice people, because despite the fact that they don't know you at all, you evidently didn't have any other plans for Thanksgiving. So somebody on your behalf asked if they could bring you to their house on Thanksgiving. Right, I chose to join my Just girlfriend. a second. Who was that? My girlfriend, Evelyn. This is the girlfriend? Yes. Does your girlfriend know the plaintiffs? Yes, she does. Both of them? Yes. Do you live with your girlfriend? Yes, we do. How long have you lived together? Uh, going on almost a year. And you have a dog. How old is your dog? She's three. So you had the dog well before you were living with your girlfriend? I actually had about a month prior to that. I just adopted just, her. Just a sec. So the dog was a couple of years old when you got the dog? Yes. So you really didn't? know the dog. You got the dog from where? From the animal shelter. What kind of dog is it? She's an American bully. She's a pit bull? Yes. That you had just gotten from the animal shelter? Correct. You got where I'm going? I, I see where you're going, Your Honor. Now, where I'm going is where a normal person goes. Yes. Which is you and your girlfriend and a child, right? Yes. Whose child? My child. Your child is how old? She's 11. So they don't know you. They don't know your child. Correct. They know your girlfriend. How do you know the girlfriend? Um, she actually is a family friend. Whose family? My family. I've known her my whole entire life. Did you know that they didn't have plans for Thanksgiving? I s reached out to her in October, and I asked her if she wanted to come over for Thanksgiving. And what did she say? She was very happy that I reached out to her, and uh, we had plans. She was going to stay the night. The next day, we were going to go motorcycle riding with my family, and so her plan was to stay the night. With the boyfriend? Yes. And his child? Yes. When did they discuss bringing the dog with them? She didn't discuss the dog until about an hour before she was on her way to my house. On Thanksgiving Day? Yes. So about an hour before, I want you to tell me about that phone conversation. It was actually a, mes a message on Facebook Messenger. Do you have that? I do. I'd like to take a look at it. Don't speak to her. Okay. What's your first name? Evelyn. Evelyn. First of all, you don't know who this dog is because you've had the dog for a few weeks in your house. You don't know whether the pit bull is friendly not friendly, why the dog was put in the pound. You don't know anything about the dog. You have nice people who invite you for Thanksgiving dinner a month in advance, and then you spring on them the morning that you're coming. We have to bring the dog. It's wonderful with babies. It's wonderful. It doesn't even bark. Do you understand? That's real gall. That's real gall. May I add something? You can add nothing. OK. I'm saying this to the tens of millions of people who will watch this program in repeats, originals, whenever. When I'm long gone, if you're invited to someone's home for an event, and especially if it's a stranger, don't bring or ask to bring your dog. It's annoying. It's annoying whatever kind of dog it is. It's especially outrageous if it's a dog that you don't know, that you just got, that's huge, and that ultimately bit their dog, this very friendly, Nothing dog, very friendly, wouldn't do a thing, bit their dog, and there were a lot of vet bills. Who do you think should pay for that? Oh, there weren't any vet bills. That dog hadn't been to a vet in two years, according to them. There were... No, she died. She passed away. As a result of As this? A result. Yes. Yes. In front of an entire horrified family. On Thanksgiving, three and it was my one -year -olds, birthday. Three three-year-olds and a, a seven-year-old. Just a second. Is what you're telling me that the dog died on Thanksgiving Day or within a on Thanksgiving, on her birthday. Five minutes. 